right so I, you have seen the thumbnail we will create a glass shader this glass shader is mainly for glass bottles i don't think this will look as good as it does on normal glass so we will start with a glass bsdf and in between this and the material output we want a mix shader and this one we need a transparent and then we copy this sh mix shader and plug it in like this again and something i like to do is adding a light path and having this is shadow ray and this will make so the glass doesn't have any shadows and for realistic look you might want to unselect this but since this is faster to render with i usually dust this sorry this one will not go in here we will make another glass bsdf and plug it in here and these two glass bsdfs we want to change the colors of them to green and blue and this is just to make the glass just slightly more realistic and i will just change them to very small amount something like that and then we can change the roughness to 0.02 for them both then for that template look we want to add a bump nap and we also want to set the strength to very low and also the distance to very low and then fr from the height we want a noise texture a noise texture and if you're using a earlier version of blender you want a musgrave texture and with the help of node wrangler i can press ctrl t but if you don't have node wrangler go to go to file no edit preferences and then search for add-ons and then no Drangler but if you don't want to do that you can just press shift A and search for mapping and coordinates there in here we want to change the UV and we also want to change the amount of templates we have so I will set this to something like 600 and I also turn down the detail and roughness to zero so the reason we have two glass shaders is because we want to add some randomness of the uh, templates and we can do this by just copying like this hold your left mouse click and then shift shift D move it down like this and then just plug it in on the normal down here and then to make them sort of different we can change the scale to 590 and we can also turn up the roughness a little bit if you want to you can mix with these uh, settings here too but i will not do that then we can add another mix shader here and then plug in the transparent node here too and right now it will look something like this but we can change this by adding a brightness and contrast like this and then we change the brightness and contrast like that so we set the brightness to negative 2.3 and the contrast to 2.8 and then you will get a glass shader that looks like this and also if you want to you can change the color of the transparent to slightly blue or green I tend to move it towards green a little bit more and then you get that perfect look of a glass bottle so this is the glass shader I hope you liked this video and if you did please give it a like and if you want to see more of these videos don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next video